My God, that information has now come out, the web is following this news closely, and you won't miss any details. But before I give you that news, I want to remind you that you're very welcome on this channel. But don't forget to sign up and leave your like to receive news in real time. So come on. Amanda Bynes was reportedly placed in a 72-hour psychiatric prison, a source close to the situation told NBC News on Monday, March 20. Although the 36-year-old actress' longtime lawyer shared that she was not in a position to comment on the situation, the source added that she hasn't been in contact with her family for some time. The former Nickelodeon star was reportedly seen walking through downtown Los Angeles without any clothes on Sunday, March 19, according to TMZ. The All That student allegedly waved to a passing car and told the driver that she was returning from a psychotic episode. She then called 911 alone and was taken to a police station, where the mental health team determined that she needed to be placed in a 5,150 psychiatric prison. Prison allows someone who is experiencing a mental health crisis to be detained for 72 hours for psychiatric hospitalization because of a potential threat of injuring himself or others, or becoming severely disabled. Already leaves your like in this video, IT is very important for you, stay informed about news that we post daily here. We just have to thank you. Continuing the news. Bynes was scheduled to appear at the 90s Con in Hartford, Connecticut this weekend, but pulled out on Friday, March 17, shortly before the event began. The convention's producer, that S4 Entertainment, revealed the news via Instagram, noting that the California native suffered from an undisclosed illness. During the All That panel on Saturday, March 18, Bynes' former colleague Kel Mitchell asked fans to send a prayer to Easy A's star to feel better but did not reveal further details about his health. Keenan Thompson, who starred alongside Mitchell, 44, in Keenan and Kel, replaced Bynes at the event as a surprise guest. Bynes rose to fame as a child star in the late 1990s, appearing on All That before landing his own spin-off, The Amanda Show. She went on to star in a number of successful teen comedies, including She's the Man, What a Girl Wants, and Easy A. What news? What did you think of this situation? We want to hear your opinion, leave US comments, as it is very important for the channel. One hug, see you next time.